hello guys welcome to the channel in today's video i'm going to show you how to go ahead and connect your howler f75 max keyboard to your laptop phone and your ipad all right so i'm going to show you how you can actually go ahead and connect this keyboard to your three devices using this keyboard you will notice there are three different methods you can connect this keyboard we have the bt we have the wired and the 2.4 g the 2.4 g will let you connect the usb directly to your laptop this is useful for only desktop or laptop now the wired option allows you to connect type c cable from the keyboard to your laptop or ipad now the bluetooth option allows you to connect to three devices at a time and you can switch between these three devices without having to use the usb cable and the type c cable in this video i'm going to show you how to do it using the bluetooth and not the usb c usb and type c by default the bluetooth is going to be on wire just switch to the bluetooth section or the bt section now i'm sure you can see the keyboard lights on the screen in order for you to connect the aula f75 max keyboard you need to go ahead and hold the fn on your keyboard and press one two or three now i'm going to go ahead and do it for the first one which is hold fn then press one hold it for a few seconds now once you hold fn and one you will notice it's going to show BT pairing on your screen. As you can see right there, BT pairing, BT1 pairing. So now I can go ahead and connect it on my desktop. Now, on my desktop, all I just have to do is to click on add device. Since I'm actually using a, I'm using a Windows device right now, I'll click on add Bluetooth. Then I'm going to search for the Bluetooth. And as you can see here, it's showing Aula F75 Max. I'm going to click on it. And as you can see right now, it's already connecting to the keyboard now it says keyboard connected now in order for you to connect the second device which is your ipad you can actually hold fn on your keyboard and press 2. now you'll notice immediately i pressed fn and 2 is showing bt2 pairing so now i can go ahead and connect it on my ipad now if you notice on my ipad it's showing aula f75 max 2 so i'll click on it and it's going to connect and now as you can see it says peer so i'm going to click on peer and now device is connected now for us to be sure that this keyboard is working we can minimize this and go to a browser and just type in something now if you notice i'm typing on the keyboard and it's showing on my ipad which shows it's working now in order for you to connect this keyboard to your third device which is your phone you need to go ahead and press fn on your keyboard and press 3 on the keyboard immediately you press fn and 3 you notice it's showing bt3 pairing and now it means you can actually go ahead and go to your bluetooth on your device then connect as you can see on my phone it says aola f75 max 3 so i'm going to click on it and now it says peer i'm going to click on peer now as you can see it says aola f75 max paired in order for us to verify that the keyboard is working on the phone, I had to open notes and type in keyboards. And as you can see, I'm typing on the keyboard and it's currently typing on my phone, which shows we have been able to connect this keyboard to our phone. Now, if you encounter any issue while trying to connect this keyboard to your laptop, phone or iPad, please drop it in the comment section. Now, I believe you know how to go ahead and connect this keyboard to any of your device. Please don't forget to give this video a like and also subscribe to the channel to see more content like this. Thanks for watching and bye for now.